In this video, I'm going to show you how to buy USDT using WISE. Stick around to the end of it. Click on the token first of all and choose USDT. Select the payment method and search for WISE. As you can see, WISE transfer WISE right here. Search the amount you'd like to spend, but first of all, make sure that you swap to USD and don't use your local currency because you're not going to find any offers. Choose the amount you'd like to spend, which is $10 at least. Click on Find Offers. After doing all of this, you're going to be prompted with this page. In this page, you are going to be looking for the following. First of all, make sure that there are some offers right here. If offers don't exist, I'm going to show you a method to work with this. After doing that and finding some offers, you can either choose people that require ID verification, which are going to be a little bit cheaper than the people who doesn't require it, and you are going to click on verify your ID and actually work on verifying your ID. Now let's go back. As you can see right here in this section, I'm going to find a buyer, his reviews, the amount of online he has been and i'm looking for someone who has been online relatively for a short time okay actually this guy seems to be 11 minutes ago he has six percent above market price which is okay i'm gonna click on buy usdt right here i'm gonna be prompted with this page in this page i'm gonna be simply looking for the following i'm gonna actually go ahead see the average time which is a minute that's actually awesome positive feedbacks 168 and this seller seems legit id verified email verified phone verified and address verified all the information checks now i'm gonna also read the offer terms hi i send you a wise the fees are on me so okay i will actually need to send more than ten dollars Keep that in mind and you can also google the fees that you have. That's basically it. After checking my guy, I'm gonna click on buy now. Right here, I'm gonna be prompted with this page. In this page, I'm gonna be able to contact the buyer and I'm the seller and I'm gonna be know what's going on. If I paid it, I'm gonna click on paid right here. As I didn't actually pay this guy, I'm just going to cancel the trade. But that's basically it for you guys. Thanks.